the game show, Which Form is Right? My name is Claire Morrow and I'll be your host today. Let's start by bringing down our contestants. Drew and Emily, come on down. You're the next contestants on Which Form is Right? Alrighty, contestants, whoever buzzes in first with the correct answer gets 200 points. Here's the question. How would you say, I did my homework in Spanish? Yo, Hacer La Torreya! I'm sorry, Emily, but that is incorrect. Drew, what do you think the answer is? Yo, he say La Torreya. Drew, that is correct! You get 200 points. Now, for 100 bonus points, can you tell me how you came up with that answer? Uh, I don't know. Can you tell me? I can tell you. When using the verb hacer in the past tense, you must recognize that it is irregular and uses different rules than a regular past tense verb. The chart for hacer in the past tense is as follows. He say in the yo form. His siste in the tu form. He zo in the el ella usted form. Hisimos in the nosotros form, and hisiron in the ellos, ellas, ustedes form. Oh, I see. I have to use the preterite tense of hacer so I can say I did my homework instead of saying I do my homework. <laughs> now that you know the correct way to use hacer in the past tense, let's ask the next question for 200 points. How would you say... My mom made the bed in Spanish. Emily? Mi madre hizo la cama. That is correct. 200 points for Emily. Now, Emily, for 100 bonus points, can you tell me how you came up with that answer? Well, yes, I can. I simply just remembered the chart and then used the L, ella, usted forms of hizo to make the sentence. Now for the next question. It's an easy one for 100 points. What is the correct way to write hacer in the past tense in the nosotros form, in the ellos, ellas, and ustedes form? I know it. All right, Drew, let's hear your answer. In the nosotros form, it is hicimos. And in the ellos, ellas, and ustedes form, it is you are correct, Drew. Hisimos and Hisiron are the correct answers. You've gained 100 points. And that ties everything up at 300 points. We're going to jump right into our final question. Whoever answers this question correctly wins the game. Contestants, are you ready? Yeah. How do you say... It was hot in Spanish. I might know that one. I don't know. Do we need another lesson? Yes! All right. When talking about the weather in the past tense, you must use hacer in the el, ella, usted form, which is hizo. So to say it was cold, you would say hizo frío. Or to say it was windy, you would say hizo viento. But don't forget the two irregular forms when you are talking about the weather. The two oddballs are it rained, which is levo, and it snowed, which is nevo. Now do you understand how to say weather in the past tense? Oh, yes! Eureka! Woohoo! Now for the final question again. Whoever wins this one wins the whole game. Here's the question. How do you say it was hot in Spanish? Drew, you buzzed first. Yay! Do you know the correct answer? He's all color! Drew was correct! He wins one million dollars and this lovely trophy! <laughs> no! Uh, that concludes our episode for the day. Thank you for joining us and we'll see you next time on Which Form is Right? <laughs>